Why didn't you? This bag thingy. It is a pretty nice bag. It wasn't right. It wasn't our stuff. That's real good of you. Look, what do you want me to say? I don't want you to say anything. I want you to know what happened. Have you ever hurt somebody you care about? Mm-hmm. Yes, of course. Who? My wife. Clementine said she wasn't with you. I heard her a long time ago. How? In a lot of ways. Hashtag honesty. She traveled for work. I didn't like that. I wanted a family. A reasonable thing to want. So we fought, and it made my biggest fear come true. Got sick one day on my way to class. Canceled it and went home. Found her there with someone else. Killed him. Damn. Now we know what happened, I was guys. Mad at her for so long, and I can't imagine how much pain she felt. How about you? I hurt her so bad. My son Adam went missing. I took him out hunting even though my wife said he was too young. I figured he had to learn. I came back without him and the look on her face said, You are a monster. <coughs> we all went out looking for him. We never found him. I hurt her so bad. And then we came back. Oh, I know your feels. And all our stuff was gone. Your people, Lee. How do you know? That asshole in the ball cap. His stupid fucking wife. Mm -hmm. I could have earned her trust back if they hadn't made our situation so desperate. I'm sorry. The hungrier we got, the more she blamed me. Until she finally took our daughter Elizabeth and left. They didn't get far. I found them a day later. Oh, God. In the road. Oh, God. Do I look like a monster to you? No. No. I'm not like you. You killed a man with a pitchfork right in front of a little girl. I would do it differently if I could. You abandoned a defenseless, grieving woman. I wouldn't do that again either. You brought her to the most dangerous place in this city where she could have died. I couldn't leave her at the house alone. She would have been better off! He's yelling at me. How could you know all this? Because he stopped us. You're a monster. You're a murderer and a thief. And I'm going to hurt you so bad. I didn't steal anything, bro. It doesn't have to be this way. You can't take care of anyone. After I found Clementine on my radio, I wasn't even mad at you. I was coming for the others. For revenge. But the more I heard about the things you did and the danger she was in, our plan changed. Our plan? Lee, listen to me. I need you to hear this before what happens next. I can take care of her. We can have a family. Can you, you cuckoo balls? I bet you don't even know how old 
old she is. She's eight. Wrong. She's nine. But her birthday was six days ago. Damn. I know how to be a dad, you know. She wouldn't be exposed to what she has been with you. Look, I was bitten. You were what? Yeah. I probably don't have a whole lot of time. Wow. Okay, then. I'm sorry again for your family. Me, too. I'm glad this didn't have to get violent. Hey, honey. I think this is all gonna work out. What are you... I'm glad too. What? I wish it wouldn't have had to get this bad, but it's all over, hon. Isn't it? Just about. I hate seeing you like this. I just miss your smile, honey. Oh. I miss you so much, Tess. Well. You're gonna like Clementine a lot, though. She's not Lizzie, but she's sweet. She wouldn't hurt a fly. <laughs> That's that's what I'm thinking. I have no idea. Do you like his bag now, Anubis? Do ya? Do you like the crazy man's bag? I, I, I. It's okay. It's okay. I. <laughs> Your arm's gone. Why? That's so scary. Accident. We'll talk about it somewhere safe. You don't say. <coughs> yeah, I know. Uh, Clementine, we don't have much time. Okay. I'm sorry, Lee. I'm sorry. Shh. It's okay, sweetie. We need to get you somewhere safe. And then we have to talk, okay? <laughs> Yeah. Everything's What's okay in now. the bag? We need to figure out how to get out of Savannah as fast as we can. Give it to her. Hey. You weren't afraid. I was. You didn't act like it. I know. I am now. It's okay. Hey, girl. Which way out? Through there. Oh, through the door? Yeah, I couldn't figure that out. Knew it! Jesus. Psycho! Don't look in there. No, I know. The people I just played with were like, holy shit, he's a beast. Because I doubled their kills. I had 250 something kills. Asked load of precision shots and assists and generated more orbs than anybody else in the game. Which way out? Uh, so like, oh, okay, fine. I wanted to get the hatchet back. Can I, can I get my hatchet back, please? Where's my hatchet? Demacia. Give me my hatchet! 
Grrr. What the fuck? Fine. Whatever. Hey. Sign. I know it. Buster. You're covered in all that gross stuff. I had to get through a bunch of them to get here. That's how we'll get out of Savannah. Ew. Ew. Thank you for getting the freaking hatchet. Um. Alright, well. Or like a scarf. Here, have some organs. Good. Are you done? Sure. You can put it on her face. Should probably cover her there. skin. That should do it. Oh. I hope so. <laughs> and you're missing something. Her hat. I thought it was gone. Cover the hat and stuff. I thought you were gone. Thank you. Gross. Stay right next to me. Walk very slowly. Don't look around. And don't panic. Mm -hmm. I'll keep you safe. Do 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 do. really walking like a zombie. He's got the zombie thing down pat. Safe and just let it all out. Okay. 